Only as intended. Uh, repair please. Sell junk. Thank you. Be well. I will. I'm always well. Sneak by, sneak by, sneak by, sneak by, sneak by, sneak by. Ow. Oh. Almost. Almost did it. Okay. Uh, sneaky, sneaky. Wonder how many episodes I've recorded. Support to ground team. Sithrat's men got us into Stronghold One scanners. Radiation levels spike just ahead of you. This is Nadrin. I believe that the radiation levels indicate the Hut's Isotope 5 prototype droid is active. <coughs> After all this time, I'm looking forward to seeing what this isotope can do. Conventional weapon droid could theoretically penetrate the droid's shield. In practice, the firepower required would be equal. Molecular disruption units, as defined as skeleton weaponers. Apologies for non standard measures. It may be possible to complement your personal weaponry with Stronghold 1's automated defenses. You would need to survive long enough to reprogram the facility's guns. What about taking control of the prototype? It could be a major asset. Unfortunately, its systems are separate from the facilities. Transferring data, upload the software into the automated defenses. I will humbly work with Lord Sithrat to target the Isotope 5 droid. Get ready then. And good luck in there, ground team. Ground team? It's just me, for Christ's sake. Well, me and Malawi. Hello. Oh, snap. Wow, I w in that cutscene, I was so close to it. Now I'm so far away. Okay. Okay, so the next 12 minutes of this was a bit of a mess, and uh, I'm about to show you why. Okay, so what you're about to witness is possibly one of the most boringest boss fights I've actually ever fought, I've ever been in, to be honest. It's one of those rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. Um, so we'll start this one off. Yeah, I've, I've pretty much done this boss. I've done this twice now, and it's and I've died twice. So I'm gonna try this a third time. You gotta do this, and they'll attack the droid for you. And then you got to go to I don't know why I just went up here because that's not where I'm supposed to go. Then I need to go to the other side. Over here. Got to look. Got to watch out for that because that will just do damage to you. And then the other side will attack. Then you go upstairs and you turn this emergency contaminant laser off, which will basically stop a whole bunch. Which this laser basically stops a whole bunch of um, fluid just sort of fall down onto the actual droid itself. And there's a whole bunch of droids about to come to get me. But it destroys its own droids. Sometimes. Oh dear. Poor droid. And then you do it again. And then watch the magic. While you attack droids that appear from nowhere, because it basically, because uh, once it's taken enough damage, it basically goes into hibernation mode. So it's like, no, stop attacking me, stop attacking me, and it doesn't take any damage from there. And then after that, 
fluid has come down, you'll be able to attack it again. And then it's basically rinse and repeat after rinse and repeat. You just do it again. <sighs> this, is, this would be more interesting if there was more people here, but it's just me. So it's not fun, this part. I'm disappointed in this fight, but what can you do? Avoid all that, and I didn't again. Ow, ow! I'm gonna die again. Malavai, I need you to heal me. No, I don't want to go there. You're stable. So yeah, this is basically the fight. Well, heal yourself then. And again. There's a droid up there. I got to kill. Got, I got to kill. And they're dead. Well, almost. Okay, that's that done. We're halfway there. Well, just over half. And I'll get myself healed a bit because I need to heal myself. Malavite, you need to run. You need to run, Malavite. Damn it, Malavite. Look what you just did. Look what you just did. Look what you just did. Move, Malavite! Move! Oh my god! This is one of the downsides of this fight. Not impressed with this fight at all. Not impressed. See, Malavite's dead. I just... Uh, I don't know anymore. Oh dear. And if I'm not careful, I'll gain a lot of damage. You don't get much time to do this either. I, you don't get much time! Come on! Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh. Ow. And I'm gonna die in a second.
And it's defeated. Bloody hell. What kind... What kind of a fight was that, Bioware? Oh my god. Sorry, I don't, I don't mind. To, I don't like raging, but what... What kind of a fight was that? I didn't like that fight whatsoever. <laughs> right, I can... I can carry on now. Oh my god, that was a nightmare to do. Oh god. Right. I took five storage tank. Support team, I found storage tanks, but they're mostly empty. There's only one sample left. Confirmed. Low levels of ISO 5 persist in the background, but no immediate large quest quantities are present. The huts could have transported the rest of the stockpile before we arrived. They may have known we were coming. We'll figure this out. Radiation levels increasing, multiple sources. Identifying two dozen power signatures. Wavelengths resemble those of Isotope 5 prototype droid. Oh dear. Darth Ma didn't ask for a legion of Isotope 5 droids, but that's what he's going to get. Lord Ma has specific plans. Yeah, I didn't read that part. regroup. Figure this out. Hello. Wait. I am Sajin, first archon of the New Hut Empire and Shadow Chief of the Conquest World, McCabe. English? I've been wondering about the Empire's presence here for some time. But of course, you wanted the isotope. Since when did Hut speak? When, when, what? I did not know Huts could speak English. You thought the Empire defeated and grasped for power. You should not have drawn our attention. It was an error, perhaps, but not a grievous one. The only Isotope 5 left on the Geth is locked in the planet's core, and when that explodes, there won't be any left at all. Our army of droids is being assembled at facilities across the planet. Your Empire has nothing. Rumor is, even your Emperor is missing. What if I were willing to make a deal? What do you want in return for the isotope? I want to reconquer the galaxy and restore glory to my people, of course. Now let's see how many droids it takes to eliminate you. More than one, I wager. But not many. This is Lord Sitharat. There are reinforcements coming. We are under attack. Please don't tell me I've got to do it again. Good. This one's a proper just a battle. I bloody hated that boss. as well in case a second wind <laughs> or third or fourth I don't know anymore <laughs> oh snap program termination equals online program vivisection equals online My 
My God. My Lord. My team is attempting to aid you from the security center, but we cannot hold long. Awaiting orders. What's the opposing force? What's your status? I have two men down, and we face at least 30. Lord Catharat, I'm transmitting a schematic. Now consulting with Science Bureau Geo Engineering Corps. You're going to get them all killed. We will do our duty. Bastard. Between you and Sitharat, Sitharat, we Ugh. might be able to lower the stronghold's heat shield and flood the bolt with lava. The droids would be buried in molten rock, but I doubt Sitharat's team would survive long enough to see it. Bye, Sitharat. Sitharat will obey, lower the heat shield, and obliterate those things. Fine. Looks like you'll have to disrupt the vault heat shield overrides. Sitharat's adjustments and the quake damage will do the rest. Send the schematics and locations to you now. Sitharat, you will need to use the controls after each override is destroyed. We know our part, but move quickly. The droids shall burn. Disable shield generators. Oh, I'm nearly done. Nearly done for the day. <laughs> My God, and I got a lot of editing to do as well. Jeez, a lot. Oh God, we're back here again. Oh no, I don't want to be back here. Uh, oh yeah, I got this. I could just use. Oh hello. Did you not hear all that ruckus in there? Hello, droid. I'm gonna die. Again. Oh, at least the med center's close. That's a good thing. <laughs> I suck at this game. Oh, hello again. Right. Let's get this done. Itchy ear. one is over there. Oh dear, the droid's making its way over here. Not good, not good, not good, not good. No, 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 keep away, 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 keep away. What is this anyway? Okay. Damn it, and I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I wonder if I can escape it though. That'd be nice if I could, but this is a group phase. You can't escape in a group phase. Unless you. Oh, you can only escape in a flashpoint. You can't escape in a flashpoint even. Ugh. Cannot talk. Ah! Sneaky, sneaky. Or was I even. I, I wasn't even attacking you. Oh. That's why. Obliged. Obliged. First override destroyed. Sitharat, over to you. Three more mercenaries dead. 
And the droid's back. Oh no. And it completely ignored Malavai. Somehow. No! Oh! Bum. I'm gonna run. That was my fault. Oh my god. I'm tired. That's why. Run, 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 run. Hopefully I can escape, but I doubt it. Can I escape? I mean, if I'm if there's a lift, can I just not escape onto it? And then you just can't get to me. I mean, look at that. I'm escaping now. You can't get to me now. So why doesn't the fight break? Unless he teleports up here. Unless he takes the elevator. Oh, bam. <laughs> I am so stupid. And that hurt. Ow. That really hurt. Ah. Oh, ignore all those failures. Ignore them all. Just ignore them. You did not see those failures. Sergeant Tabrex is down. My technician is bleeding on the console. But we will do our part. Heat shield at 40%. And sneaky sneaky. Oh, and I gotta kill those droids anyway. Great. Well, if I can just, I can just save with them, can't I? Ew. Idiot, Charlie. Why didn't I just do that to begin with? I think that boss fight has just sort of uh, got rid of my confidence a bit. It was such a bad fight that I kind of lost a bit of my confidence. And I'm gonna die, really? How the hell does it expect me to do this fight? Can I not use... Wait, what? What just happened? Oh my god, this is ridiculous. This is getting ridiculous now. Really is. What? This is just getting ridiculous now. I We were fighting, I was trying to use a heroic moment and the fight stopped. What? Oh my god. Oh. Not fun. Not fun. And now I've got to try and fight this bloody thing again, even though it's not going to work. <sighs> How long has that got? That has. 50 seconds. Okay, let's see what I can do in 50 seconds. Use this, use that, and then leap. Ow. See, how am I expected to defeat this bloody thing? Ah, 
I'm no match for it. There we are. Bloody hell. I forgot to disrupt everything, that's why. <laughs> Jesus. Right. Last one. Sitarat, your status. My men are dead. I am alone against many. But I know my duty. Lowering the heat shield. When you fall, it will be for the Emperor. Die well, old Sitharat. Die well, my Lord Roth. Ouch. No signal. We should get out before we have a flat reception. We'll see what goes. This is a lot seriously, this is a lot darker than it used to be. Really is. So much darker. I like it when it's darker because there's more motion towards it. But even so, it's a bit. It's kind of scary just how dark it is. But. That's life. Anyway, let's get hand in this quest and finish up. Finally! After some terrible moments. Who's that? Oh, it's that guy again who contacted me earlier from the Dark Council. The Hots are aware of your presence and the Isotope 5 is gone. Yes, my lord. We have a sample and there's more in the core, but I failed. Today, three planets fell to Republic Butchers. I sacrificed those worlds and my legions to buy time for this operation. You are responsible for what happens on Maquette. I am the Chosen of the Emperor. I am undefeated in battle. Do not doubt me, Ma. You misunderstand. We have a chance to forge a new empire. An empire united in loyalty and passion, not simplistic dedication to an unseen emperor. But fail to procure the isotope 5 and the empire dies forever. Solve this. Come inu nemuk. We have been analyzing Naja-naya options and our conclusion is unfortunate. We cannot extract isotope 5 from the droids. And we can't mine the isotope ourselves before the planet explodes. Even if the huts cooperated, we'd never get enough. Maybe there's another option. Could we synthesize the material? Or mine it on another world? Makeb is the only known source of the isotope. The conditions under which it forms appear unique to the planet's core. So we're back at the start. Without Makeb, there is no isotope 5. If the isotope 5 is locked in the core, and the core is about to detonate, then that's where we need to focus. How do we slow the destruction of the planet? How do we save Makeb? I don't know if that's possible. Saving a planet would require significant innovation. I can make no promises. Our empire is imperiled. Makeb must be saved, or all is lost. Your life is nothing. Only your obedience matters. Begin. I still think you look like a Cathar Chiss. If I may, my lord, they're making progress. But even if we save Makeb, the timing... If the Huts realize the planet's not about to blow, they'll never leave willingly. We can't afford a ground war. 
We still need them to evacuate. We don't even know what's possible. Take it one problem at a time. Forgive my interruption. We are ready to present. Terrace engineering post here. Stabilizing Muckett's core is theoretically possible, but we don't have enough data. Quest Geo Survey Station. We need to induce the Isotope 5 inside McKeb to release an energy pulse, allowing us to map all of its deposits. To perform this invaluable experiment, however, you would need to travel underground to the core of the planet. We recognize the inconvenience. Summarize the science for me, Nedrin. What am I doing down there? Upon reaching the core, you would cause the isotope 5 deposits to vibrate, releasing a pulse to harmless of harmless radiation. Our instruments could then locate the deposits. Once all unstable elements are mapped, we can consider how to safely adjust the cause of compensation. If we do this, our best access point is the laser drill shaft, where the isotope 5 was originally discovered. The shaft runs kilometers under a mining station, and it's been abandoned, so probably treacherous. But less chance of hut interference. Every second this planet comes closer to destruction. I'll go. Keep working on the plan. We will provide all necessary equipment and speak once you arrive on site. Be careful. The center of a planet isn't built for people. To be honest, it wasn't built at all. Oh, achievement. Is that for... Ah, that's for doing stealing thunder. Okay, so I got that, that, and that, and that to go. Right, so what can I pick up? Uh, don't need, don't need, okay, oh wow. Get all this, do I? Okay. So, I was gonna say 619, that was nothing. So, very close to level 52, but looks like we're not gonna get there right now. Uh, anything in the lockbox? Yeah, I'll see what my characters want. So that'll be it for the time being, guys. I'm just a little bit annoyed about that boss fight. That was such a pathetic boss fight. Thanks for watching, guys, and I shall see you next time, and farewell. Hey, guys, so the server's going down in around about 11 minutes for scheduled maintenance for patch 2.0.0A. So I thought just before we do that, just to add on to episode 9 or the beginning of episode 10, I don't know which one I'm going to put it on yet, uh, I'm going to check the mail because I got two mail from um, these two people, Major Re uh, Ravine, Locus Status. Um, to whosoever serves as o operational commander on Planet Makeb, I don't claim to know what's going on down there. Darth Maher has instituted a need-to-know policy regarding your mission, and despite the fact that I'm military intelligence coordinator of the, for the sector, I apparently don't need to know. Nonetheless, I am told that our agent codenamed Lurker was eliminated by your forces. We're having enough trouble staying apprised uh, with Imperial intelligence gone. Must you remove a few so the few sources we have left? You have our full support, of course, and I realize your mission is vital to the continuation of the Empire, but be aware of that how hard things are out here. Warm regards and best wishes, etc. Um, server admin. I don't want the server to go down. I wanted to do some more, re more recording, but it's not going to happen. What's in the lockbox? Uh, nothing for me. Maybe for my companions, who knows. Um, and from Darth Ravage... Lord Sithrat was stained by the blood of the traitor. By the blood of the traitor, it was it was Darth Malgus who brought him out of the academy on Karak Korriban. It was Malgus who Sithrat followed at the Battle of Ilum. I argued for Sithrat's execution, for, but for practical reasons, I permitted him to join the mission to Makeb. He did not deserve the, that chance, but I understand he died well. His shame will be purged from the records. And I got another luck box as well with something which I can't use. Of course. And then for the final thing, let's just see what Malavai wants because I, I, I just, I, it's annoying me that I just keep seeing his icon. And I just want to see what he wants. My lord, the new alluvial dampers have been installed and the hyperdrive tested to my satisfaction. This ship is now the most hyperspeed ready vessel in the galaxy. Yeah, basically he bought some new hyperdrive stuff and he put it in the ship. So yeah, the credit is yours, Quinn. This is just the beginning, my lord. I will tirelessly work toward improving this ship and the effectiveness of everyone in it. Awaiting your next order. Oh, is that it? I didn't even gain any affection from that. Christ's sake. Nobody else wants to talk to me? No? 
not even you, TV, all right? Welcome back, Master. I've just completed a new meal plan for your culinary pleasure. Uh, I guess not. So I guess that's for it. Well, that's it for the time being, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And we're going to light speed to Makeb. We'll finish on a light speed to Makeb. Uh, Jesus, 2300? Jesus. And I shall see you next time. And farewell.